<laughs> okay, somebody take it away. Welcome back to the broadcast. So glad you're with us. Oh, jeez. Um, so we wanted to talk about we wanted to talk about how difficult it is sometimes to cultivate friendships as adult women who have busy lives and busy schedules, sometimes families, um, work. How do you really get out there and make friends? Because it's a lot different than when we were kids, making yeah. friends on the on the playground, right? Right, right, in, in the classroom, whatever. Mm -hmm. yeah. You if know you, what, it, go ahead, I'm sorry. I, I was just gonna say, if you talked all the time like I did, it was kinda easy. <laughs> yeah, well you have one of those personalities that's easy to gravitate to. Um, for me, Lisa, it's, it's like air. Girlfriends are like, I agree. I essential. They are essential. Yeah, it's like I can't. I mean, I love oh, you and your girlfriends. Oh, doesn't. Yeah. Look, a few of them. That uh -huh. was Super Bowl Sunday. Um, we decided to fly back and not stay for the game, and like that was one of the best moments because you, you know, you kind of went for being at this huge event. And then that was the funnest part of the weekend for me was just being at home on my couch, just hanging out with my girlfriends and my yeah. family. And so I don't know. I, I'm I'm real protective of my. I will fight for my girlfriends. Like that is good yeah. for that's you. That's sacred for me. Mm -hmm. I make time. And we even have a girlfriends group. We actually meet once a month, and we pray um, for our husbands and are just in our lives. And then we have oh, birthday lunches, that. and we are like committed to those. So that's kind of our girlfriend time out. We do girlfriend nights out. I mean, we just. And we you make look, it a party. You look forward to it. Absolutely. I do. Yeah, patio, we need. Time, patio time with my girlfriends with wine and, and just we laugh and it's just I, I crave it. And sometimes I don't I don't get as Aww. much time to do it. Aww, yeah. cute. You know, and I, I wish I did. I wish I had more time. I wish I, I made an effort to make more time. So we have um, Dr. Kate Namas, who is uh, she's a contributor to D Moms magazine. And I saw this interesting article that she did for D Moms about cultivating friendships as women. She gives a few tips and I think they're really great ideas. She says, invite your girlfriends to your new mom's book club. Or, oh. you know, and I don't think it really has anything to do with necessarily being a mom, I think just being an adult woman with busy right. life. So, Courtney, yeah. of course. Right. You know, no, I think same, for me, it's you. always about quality time with my friends. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't have a ton of time just between, you know, this and the blog and, and the Bravo show. It's my time is really rare. Oh, it's oh, right. Prada, of course. Oh, that's you, that's I was going to say, you got faster book That's girlfriends. a trip that me and my girlfriends took to Marfa recently. Um, and there's oh, a I Prada art installation there. And we, but that was really special to me because two of my best friends have children. And then the, one, the other one, Tori, she's single. And so the, their schedules compared to Tori and I's is different because they have children and they're breastfeeding and, and they have husbands and mm -hmm. all that. So I like to carve out, like, let's do a weekend or let's do one night a month. Um, and let's make that time really quality. Like I'd rather have smaller doses of great time with them mm -hmm. than yeah. have mm -hmm. to talk to them every day or have to see them every day. But right. that, that because time it gets is so unrealistic special. as you get busier, right. right? Yeah. So Dr. Kate says, yeah, create some kind of a club, a book club or something. That, or a wine that everybody. Club. I have a book yes, club. A wine club. Yeah. You mm -hmm. do. Okay. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. um, and love it. See. There were yeah. there were two other tips, and I thought they were really good. Find an exercise buddy. So exercise yeah. with your girlfriend, Courtney, thing, you're yeah. looking at me funny. No, I love that. I think that's important, too. Yeah. Lisa and I have been trying to work out. And <laughs> I was going to say, y'all are supposed to start like Pilates or something. Or uh, yoga. Last week, well, and I, she texted me and said, I won't be mad if you can. <laughs> that's so good. It was my way of saying, and then, like, I ten so minutes don't later, feel like She it. sends yeah. me a picture of a martini glass. And I was like, <laughs> OK. Well, I have some tips for friends. And, and, and here's real friendship. When you're sad, I will jump on the person who made you sad like a spider monkey. See? And yes. when you're blue, I will try to dislodge whatever's choking you. Mm -hmm. And when you smile, I will know that you're plotting something and I want to be in on it. Uh -huh. And when you're scared, we'll hightail it out of there. And when you're worried, I'll tell you horrible stories about how much worse it could be until you stop whining. Bunch of th things like that. Oh, I yeah. like those. Will you please no be one of my stuff? new best friends? Yeah. Because, uh, yeah, yeah, no I want you on my team. Yeah. Yeah. Elbow some it. people. Yeah. That, that's what it's about, though. That's you gotta, right. Oh, yeah. You gotta be able Sense to. of humor, right? Yes. Don't you think? And you just standing up laugh. for your friends, too, I yes. think is really important. Like that your friends have your back that if someone says something negative about you or treats you or disrespects you that your friends are really they'll I my friends I always say that they will take a bat and go Tanya Harding on you like yeah, they, yeah. they will yeah. we they have, fight for me and I, and I appreciate we, that we have Dr. Kate here and I, I want to ask her we've got the camera on her over there is there what what is your what is your most important tip when you are talking to women who 
who are having problems with this because especially if you get into a new relationship mm -hmm. or you you don't have as much time unfortunately. right I, I tell them that they must make it a priority because men will come and go but your female friends are the ones that are going to keep you here oh, yes. Amen. Yes. <laughs> amen to that that is so great we're actually going to be talking to dr. Kate coming up here she's going to talk about um, diet and fertility mm -hmm. if you are trying to get pregnant someone you know is trying to get pregnant there are um, certain foods that you should be eating and probably certain foods you should yeah. um, stay away from, like <laughs> the martini that I was happy to <laughs> And really quick motto, girlfriend motto. If you want to be or have the best girlfriends, you got to be a good girlfriend. Yeah. Bottom line. True. So you, true. You got to be. and take. There you go. That's and, it. And no, no high maintenance girlfriends. That's, That's right. all. No. When they get mad at you, if you don't want no. Easy, easy. Oh, okay. Easy.